there's a company advertises this, that they exist for the sole purpose of getting your book onto the New York Times bestseller list. It's a company oh. that says, you pay us, we will get you on the list. We will get that stamp on there and publishers will go to them because of the way they're able to scheme the system. There was actually a book published, I forget the author's name, but there was a book published on how to cheat the New York Times bestseller list. A lot of authors, one way they'll try to cheat the system, you bulk order copies and you bulk order a ton, 10,000 copies at these bookstores specifically and try to get this really pushed out there just so you get on the list for a week and then can forever say you were a New York Times bestselling author. Now, the New York Times response to that. The response is a classification of what technically is a bulk order. 30 books in one particular time at one bookstore. What the counter to that is these publishers and these companies buying 25, 29 books and just going under the bulk order. New York Times can kind of see that. That's why it's not a hard number. It's a fluctuating editorialized list. 